Ricky Martin and Enrique Iglesias joining forces to co-headline a worldwide tour for the first time ever. And it all starts here, where we went to meet them in the heart of Las Vegas. How does it feel to be back? I'm, this is, I'm this nervous is. as hell. <laughs> I'm nervous. Once known as the kings of Latin pop, credited with starting the so-called Latin explosion in the 90s. Martin and Iglesias topped the charts as some of the original crossover artists with hits like Bailamos, Maria, and of course, Live in La Vida Loca. Now a homecoming for an entire generation of fans. I remember going to your concert so cool. when I was little and I was in the front row Un pasito pa'lante, Maria. Like, hey. I was so excited. Could you have envisioned that, you know, people who don't even speak Spanish would be singing along to Spanish songs? I personally did. I felt it in my soul. At the time, they called it the Latin explosion. I'm like, this is not an explosion. This is not going to go away. This is here to stay. <laughs> We've always been there, and, um, and this is not going to stop. Which is why they say this tour couldn't come at a better time. This is the first time we're doing it since, obviously, the pandemic. The crowd wants it. The crowd needs it, and we also, we need it. Been missing it. A lot, a lot. It's been heavy. It's been heavy. This pandemic has been heavy on all of us, um, on me as well, and I just, I just want to get out there. Out there to share a bit of joy and their culture with the world. We are currently celebrating Hispanic heritage. Just that. I feel it. I know. It's it's in the aire. Just we can feel it, just it right? Like Does this month have a special significance for you right now? To me, it definitely does, and me being raised here in the U.S., being Latino, uh, speaking both English and Spanish, never perfect English, never perfect Spanish, because I grew up in Miami. It's a dialect. <laughs> so, um, I mean... Una mezcla. Uh, it is. <laughs> proud. I'm just proud. Proud to be, you know, Latino. And, it's, and I, I always go back to my kids. I mean, we're parents now, and for us to be able to talk about really where we come from, it's for them to go through life celebrating who they are all year long. Which is why now they're performing to their own rhythm, one hit or baile at a time. What do you say to all the young Latino aspiring artists? To be proud, to go for it. The sky's the limit. Don't be afraid to, to learn from others. And, and don't be afraid of being knocked down. You know? This is a tough business. You, know? you just get up, keep on going and going. And we do this because we love it. And so do their fans. I'm so excited for you guys. Oh, I know. I'm so excited. Wow. I know. More games I know, Wait. right? I was like, ah, oh, they're so great. So their tour kicked <laughs> off this weekend and continues through the fall. Ricky told me they already have 155 tour oh, dates on the calendar and no. counting with the two just crisscrossing across the country to give the fans what they want. And something I thought was just so poignant was, was their honesty about how difficult this past year has been, not just for them, but for the Latino community as a whole with COVID and job losses. And they said this is their way to give back to everyone and to remind them the power of music and culture is here to stay for years years and, to come. And those two hadn't seen each other, had they, since uh, until your interview, is that no, right? when we yeah. sat down for the interview, they said, Ay, hola, hermano, te quiero, I love <laughs> yeah. you, like, it's great to see you. And it was their first time wow. meeting as their tour was about to kick Just off. Just one follow-up, where are our tickets? Yeah. Morgan, we want to go. So, I actually have to say, you all were invited to their concert. Really? I am here with Wait. a personal oh. invitation. Oh. Yeah. Oh. This yeah. is I know. You didn't know. You know that was coming. 156 shows. I think we need to do the one in New York. Oh, yeah. Okay. 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 Yeah, I might go to Vegas, watch Raider games, see the show. Yeah, let's go. Thanks, Morgan. Thank you for that. Thank you, Morgan. That was fun.